Canine epilepsy can be a devastating chronic brain disease that can severely affect the quality of life for dogs and their owners. It is also a frustrating diagnosis for veterinarians to deliver because up to 30% of patients remain uncontrolled with current therapies. Epilepsy is characterized by recurrent seizures, manifestations of abnormal hypersynchronization of neurons in the brain. Glucose is the main source of energy in the brain. During seizures, however, normal brain glucose metabolism is disrupted. Moreover, the hypometabolism of glucose between seizures may be linked to imbalances in neurotransmission and changes in the excitability of neuronal membranes. Groups of hyperexcitable neurons may fire erratically, causing electrical storms of activity that drive fresh seizures. Dogs can use a specific type of fat, called medium-chain triglycerides, MCTs, as an alternative energy source for the brain. MCTs are metabolized into medium-chain fatty acids, MCFAs, in the intestine. MCFAs travel to the liver, where they are primarily converted into ketones, such as beta-hydroxybutyrate. Ketones enter the systemic circulation and cross the blood-brain barrier, serving as an alternative energy source for the neurons. Another proposed mechanism acting downstream of MCT ingestion may involve the beneficial activity of a specific MCFA, decanoic acid. This molecule is thought to inhibit the AMPA receptor, which helps propagate excitatory impulses between neurons. An AMPA blockade may help calm the electrical storm and contribute to seizure control. In a collaborative study, the Royal Veterinary College and Purina enrolled epileptic dogs currently not well controlled despite use of anti-epileptic medication and fed them a diet containing a proprietary blend of MCTs. 71% showed a reduction in seizure frequency and 14% of them became seizure free. This nutritional innovation offers a new approach to improving quality of life for the dog, the owner, and the veterinarian.